amazing day of shooting you know what's great about this it's based on reality I mean you've got a driver you got a passenger playing the game I mean just a weird thing to be sitting and hearing and feeling all the senses from one car and then driving the same car basically in the simulator at the same track at the exact same time you know, typically you're out here for a TV commercial and it's like 10 mile an hour doors locked windows up and you're just putting around we're plus 100 on every straightaway that we could get. Inches apart, sliding, smoking the tires. But the main thing is, is that it's totally in the middle of it all the time. Middle of the action. When we're chasing in a camera car, we're running flat out. That camera's like under the bumper of these cars as they're drifting around. In turn five up here, I think they're pulling over a G as he turns into that left-hander there. And you can feel it and see it there. And this is stuff you couldn't set up and fake. Laguna Seca is a, is a very demanding track. It's one of those road courses that I really enjoy. It's got a lot of different elevation changes. Then you've got the famous corkscrew. You know, you can't even see. When you turn in, left into that corner, you can't see the apex for the right side of that corner down the hill. As you make that left over the top of the corkscrew, you're turning against the sky. You know, you're literally dropping out of an eight-story building as you go over the edge there. You obviously are familiar with Laguna Seca. How do you think that'll help translate into the virtual version of Laguna Seca and Gran Turismo PSP? Uh, well, it, it translates pretty directly. The contour of every corner is all very, very exact. There's bumps, there's little camber changes that have a huge effect on the car in real life that you can, if you pay attention, you can feel them having the same effect in the game. You know, you got all the, all the key things here. When you come down the corkscrew, you have the oak tree um, here in Monterey, just like you do on the, on the screen, you know, in the, in the simulator. So it's really amazing. You can actually use the game to learn racetracks. As a, as a driver, as an enthusiast towards cars, and just to be able to be out here at Laguna Seca, any opportunity you can get, it's, it's a good day. You know, every one of these cars that we had to, in a lineup here were incredible. You know, I drove the Corvette today, 630 horsepower. You got four cars that are absolutely running flat out around Laguna Seca, and when everything works like it did, it's just fantastic. Gran Turismo, only possible on PSP and PSP Go. PlayStation.